The associative property is, is like the commutative property in that it only works for multiplication and addition. And what it says is that we can associate these numbers in this multiplication problem in any way by putting parentheses around two of them and starting by multiplying them. And it's going to keep the answer the same. So if we start with taking 3 times 4 and associate 3 with 4 before we multiply the 2, we get 12 times this 2 is 24. Or we could start with 4 times 2 by putting parentheses around them and get that this is equal to 8. And then 3 times 8 is also 24. And you can see that these numbers match up. So with multiplication, we can put the parentheses anywhere we want, multiply whichever two numbers first we want to, and still come up with the same answer. And the same is true with addition. We can associate the 8 and the 7 first and get 15 plus 6 is 21. Or we can associate the 7 and the 6 first and get 13 plus 8 is 21. This doesn't, however, work for subtraction and division because, as you can, you can see, numbers aren't going to um, come out the same if we divide 3 by 4 first as, as if we divided 4 by 2 first. It's not going to be the same. But um, it works for multiplication and addition, just like the commutative property works for multiplication and addition.